In the tissue manufacturing industry, the tissue fabric is coated during the converting stage with products called lotions. This is done with the aid of spray coaters or roll coaters. In the laboratory, we use a roll coater to simulate the roll coating process. This is a three-roll system. In this video, we show how single-sided coating is done. First, the tissue fabric is weighed on an analytical balance. This allows the exact amount of lotion coated onto the tissue to be determined after roll coating. If a support plate is needed for coating, as in the present case, the tissue is then bonded to it. The ready-to-use Leoseal TS lotion is filled into the holding tank. Roughly 200 ml of product is needed. The rolls are switched on. The steel pickup roll transfers the lotion to the rubber applicator roll. The amount of product to be applied can be adjusted by varying the pressure on the applicator roll. The higher the pressure, the narrower the nip and the thinner the coating. The speed of the rolls can also be used to vary the amount of lotion applied. The upper roll is made of rubber and serves as a transport or pressure roll to enable the tissue fabric to pass through smoothly. To ensure that the tissue fabric is coated evenly, the rolls must be coated evenly with the Lyosil lotion. The tissue fabric is now passed between the applicator roll and the transport roll. The side to be coated faces down towards the holding tank. If double-sided coating is required, the process is repeated on the second side. Some types of tissue do not require a support plate. The tissue is re-weighed and the amount of applied lotion can be determined. The area is then used to calculate the grammage in gram per square meter. VACA. Creating tomorrow's solutions.